Right, here we are. Whirly gig number, I'm not quite sure how many I've made, but this is the chicken. As you can see, all homemade. We're using these standard base as we've always used, you know, the same size base, uh, the same propeller. It's all, all exactly the same. The only thing that isn't is obviously the thing which is the chicken, which is on this one. Uh, as you can see, uh, cut out of a piece of ply, plywood and we put two wings on him uh, he actually hinges on his feet at the bottom i don't know if you can see that we sort of just cut his feet out a bit of old shelving as you know my policy is to try and always use as much uh, recycled material as possible which is what we did and we've uh, uh, given him a nice little worm here to eat <laughs> if you can see the worm uh, i did uh, this is the first chicken i've done and i've made the wings so they're adjustable can you see so you can lift them up and down however how, however you want them so uh that's it and uh, he, he swings around he swings around like that uh, so there's no wind today so i'm having to turn it by by hand but there you go there he is that's the uh that's the chicken so it's amazing what you can do uh just using that standard base using the standard uh hub thing here oh sorry using the standard hub i if you can see just using that yeah and he goes around quite well uh yeah if there's a bit of wind blows in a minute i'll come back out and show you with the wind blowing but uh there we go so that's another one of uh mr whirly gigs uh whirly gigs that's the uh the Easter chicken, shall we call him Easter? Easter, Easter, es Esther, Esther the chicken, Easter the chicken, Easter egg, yeah, Easter, yeah, eating the worm. Not much more we can say about that. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you didn't, uh, you know where to. Yeah, the wind's just getting up. Is it going to blow? It might blow. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. There we go. Whee! Look at that. Hey, wow. Look at him going, that wind. Look at that. So there he goes. Oh, I'm just going to point out two things. Uh, is that I don't know if you can see there with the. So it's a bit hard to follow here, with the wire here. I don't know if you can see on my finger. I used to use a straight piece of wire from here up to there, but you always had to measure that sort of dead on. So now what I do is I use a bit of a curved bit of a wire so I can bend it. So it's it, it's adjustable. So uh, I think you can see it better that way. Can you see, that? and that's adjustable. So which allows you to you know. To adjust it i think if I, the next chicken i do if somebody ever asked me to do that chicken i might do it with his head facing down a bit more so it looks like he's picking picking up the worms uh, i was going to put uh oh some little uh peanuts down there yeah just glue some peanuts down but i thought the other birds might pinch that so in the end i made a i made a uh a wooden worm anyway there you go signing off don't forget, uh, be good, be happy. This is Mr. Whirly Gook, Gook saying, Mr. Whirly Geek saying goodbye. And don't forget, most of all, be kind to the animals. Well, thank you very much for watching the uh, video. If you'd like to support my channel, you can do so by uh, obviously sharing and liking and subscribing to the channel. But even more, I'd appreciate it more if you'd love to buy me a cup of tea so I can dunk my biscuits into would be greatly appreciated. Follow the link in the description. Thank you.